Welcome back to another yu gi -Kan Avengers and today we've got a bit of a mail day type of thing. I brought these Yu-Gi-Oh figures off the internet and they came in this random box called Shadowlands Legend of the Five Rings. If you know what that game is all about, let me know. It's like a little deck box thing for them. But the things I've brought are inside here. And look at that. A nice few little mini Yu-Gi-Oh figures for us to check out today. I'm going to shove that over there, I'm going to check each and every one of these little bad boys out. Let's take a look at them. So up first is the Flame Swordsman. And that is absolutely beautiful. I love the little flames coming off them. Well, where are the orange meant to be? They found out given this little orange colouring to it. What a beautiful little figure that guy is. There's, a, there's the next one, which is the Wind Dragon of Ra. And that looks, I really love that. And that looks absolutely awesome. He's <laughs> got a little fire coming off his shoulders and his wings. Doing a nice little fireball there. He's got no legs. But still, can't complain for that awesome figure. Alligator Swordsman, which is all silver. Nice little look to him. He looks cool too. I love, the, love how small they are and they've got so much detail on them. There's another one which is Obelisk the Tormentor. He's got this one tone colour to him. It's nice. Thick, that one is. I've got a few like this actually. There's another one. I believe this this is blue eyes, maybe? Got a bit of a hunch in his neck. <laughs> Look at that. He's a really grumpy blue eyes. And he's got that colouring, same colour as Obelisk to him. Nice. Should all know who this one is. This is Tan Wizard. He's missing his hand with his little tan. In. Still not a little bad figure. This one looks cool. I like this one. Big wheels on his hands and a little wheel at the back. Why is that two wheels? Like I, I think I know who this card is. I think it's one of those normal yellow cards. But I can't remember his name. We have Organist. We got another Flame Swordsman. There he is. Where's his face? He's all silver, like the alligator swordsman, and he's he's kneeling down. Don't know if he, maybe he's in defense. Maybe that's what that's meant to mean. This one's quite cool. It's red eyes bee dragon. Look how wide open his mouth is. How cool is that? Yeah, one happy little dragon, is he? It's like he stumped his toe. <laughs> now we've got Joey. He he looks really, really butched. Look how big his sleeves are. Kinda reminds me of Shaggy. <laughs> but I don't know what the hell he's holding. Is it meant to be a card and a phone? His wallet? Jesus Christ. Portions on this one is terrible. On to the next card then, which is Kaba. It's a little old cowboy. There you go. Next is the magical hats, which are silver. You look metal, but it's not. It's plastic. That's quite cool. I like that one. Just a few more left now, and up next is Shadow Ghoul. Now that is an awesome figure. Look how cool that is. Details on his face. That was creepy. And his hair. And then he's got all these red eyes all over his legs. Jesus Christ, wouldn't like to go against that one. Now we've got the Amph Say what? The Amphinian Amphin The Amphinian Beast. The Amphinian The Amphinian The Amphinian The Amphinian Beast. Bruh, you no, suck. He's just yo. You want a little boy, you wanna challenge me? Yeah. He's like a little sensei, isn't he? We don't really Fantastic. The Beast of Guildford. I always love the design of this card. Such a badass one. It's, cool. it's really awesome how they made these little figures back in the day. And to go with Archiver, we've got the Yugi. Look at that face. Can we see that face? 
<laughs> Doesn't even look like him. Looks like a cosplay. Hey! And then his hair's just slicked back. Oh, nice and pointy. He's, he's got detail on his build disc at least, and he's got like a really thick card on his end. Like he's just. Oh, God. Cocky little fella, this one. Next, we've got both the blader and look at him. He's like, check out this sword, boy. You want to challenge me with this sword? I don't think so. And he's got that little colouring with the obelisk and must be a special wave they did with these little figures in a different colour. One of their rarer. Hmm. To end it all off, we have Slaver the Scared Dragon. And he too is in that colouring. Really massive, isn't it? Next to Arbalus, he's about... He's roughly the same size. Does his wings stick out a bit more? But absolutely amazing. So lastly to show you are these cards that you would get with the figures. Kind of helps you know who the character the card is and that's meant to clip onto something at the bottom here. Don't know. Can't remember what that was. The cool thing is if you turn them around. Yeah, it doesn't work. We got Joey, Kaiba, Yugi, Flame Swordsman, Wind Dragon, Ra. See that one works. You can kind of get this kind of ghostly look to the back of the card. Flame Swordsman. We got Karibo, but didn't get Karibo in the figurines. That would have been a cool figure to run. I'll get a sword. Arbalus. See if he gets one. Yeah, you can just about see. You can see him in person really well, but maybe not on the camera. Slifer. Red Eyes and the Bee Bleeder. That's the end of that video. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, let me know. Let me know if you collected any of these little mini figures back in the day and if any of these are rare and which one's your favourite. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao, ciao.